welcome again to Deep Side Gaming with Clinton. And Adam. And we're gonna play some more Dark Souls. How you feeling today, Adam? Still fucking pissed. <laughs> Here's that fucking shield. Remember? That block stuff. Oh, good. Fire's out of the way. Back down the stairs again. We know what time to have to fuck these boxes. We now know they're not barrels for sure. <laughs> is this how we're gonna do the whole Let's Play now? Is this I don't know. Crazy? It depends on how many times we get butt fucked in the next butt fucking hours. Jesus. Couldn't even buy me dinner first. It was I had to get wine dining before we get fucked. <laughs> yeah, rat, what are you fucking staring at? What so I thought, you fucking pussy, you got something to say? Uh oh, yeah, bitch, you run away. What is no, actually, no, you don't. Get over here. Come back here. Are you quite finished? No! <laughs> hey, look, that guy's pretty cool. Are you done now? Yeah. Can we, can we take it back down to acceptable levels of excitement? Fuck these, yeah. Thank you. I missed the kick. Go oh on. my gosh, that, like, it's, that knockback that you just do in Dark Souls, it's nowhere near as satisfying as just fucking kicking. Right. It just... I, uh, I don't care for a lot of Dark Souls 2's mechanics so far from what I did play. Um, things like, yeah, not being able to kick really... Um, I feel like no matter what point in the game I've been to now, I still cannot take a single hit. Like, every single hit still somehow seems like it manages to stun lock me forever. Or, well, uh, what's the term I want? Break my poise? Yeah. Yeah. Like, it seems like no matter what I'm wearing, no matter how, what type of character I've built, I just, I have no poise. I don't know if that's a mechanic of the... Thank you. Okay, bye! Of the mechanic, a mechanic of the game, or if it's just... I really just suck at the game or something. I don't know. Oh, that's a. Uh... I felt like though in Dark Souls One, it got to a point where, um, not so much that I could take plenty of hits, but that I could take a hit or two and not immediately have to like worry about. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, bye again. See, that's how you do it, buddy. You got this. Was there always three? Yeah, we just didn't make it past oh. two for a couple episodes. Oh. Heck, we've barely been to past one. Um, nah, okay. but yeah, I feel like in Dark Souls 1 I eventually got to a point where it was like... Oh, fuck you, little asshole. I may not have wanted to take too many hits, but I, I, I wasn't terrified for my life if I did yeah, get I, hit. I got greedy. I, ah, fucking damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I can't do this anymore with you. <laughs> that was pretty boring. I was gonna, I didn't calm down, it's all good. <laughs> Three whole seconds. Oh man. It's one kicking. Oh man, I can't mm -hmm. breathe. Why did you get that checked out? Probably are you, should. Are you okay? I don't know what's causing you to have this trouble breathing. Oh, I don't either. Is something funny? Cause I'm not fucking laughing. <laughs> no, but I am. You got <sighs> this, man. I have faith in you. I no, I don't. Like it's. I I'm. <laughs> Genuinely surprised at just how horrible I've been doing this entire playthrough. Oh, but we were talking about uh, trolling like p people in PvP. Yeah. So yeah, there's that a uh, like place called the Iron Keep. Um, there is a bridge that when you can join like the Dragon Covenant, uh, it's a very popular PvP spot. You know, people like people lay down the symbols to duel and all that shit. I'm right now using a weapon called the Curved Dragon. Um, I think it's Curved Dragon Greatsword, and, and apparently oh. it's to be able to find it cheap because I got this message like from <laughs> he had to have been like a 13 years old just. Just bitching me out, like, you know, how that I'm using a cheap ass weapon that he totally would have wanted if I was using that piece of shit. <laughs> oh, it was wonderful. And, like, all I said was, thank you. Thank like, you. Like, and then he got angry and angry, and, uh, and he started saying more hateful uh, shit. So I, oh, fuck! What the hell? Jeez. That is. Oh, oh! You know what? So that's how your day's gonna go, Adam. Yeah. It's, um. Um. Let's, let's go somewhere else. I'm just done with this place. There's not anywhere else to go. Oh. This is the next natural progression of the game. Well. If you're very careful with, like, you're running and dodging, you might be able to get one of them. To, I think you just got one of them to fall off. Really? Nope. What? You know what? Let's do this. Just run. Yeah, that works. They won't be able to follow me, follow me eventually. Yeah. It's... At this point, just, I don't even fucking go. care. Yeah. Oh god! Oh come on! Well, this episode's over too. No. Oh yeah, we got. Ah oh, fuck! I'm. Do you, do you do you legitimately want me to help you get past this spot? As embarrassing as it is, yeah, I just I. Okay. I I've, I've only got so many vocal cords. We've got more recording to do tonight. <laughs> I, but um, at least I can talk right now about the thing. It's yeah. So yeah, I'm. But I like I was doing really well. I've like uh I made it through all three tiers, which is, like you know winning at least thirty duels for the uh. 
um, the dragon scales to turn in. Nice. And um, oh, I I found also like that people get really pissed off if you do wield whips. <laughs> <laughs> it's just it's such a random thing to dual wield. I mean, apparently there are like builds that revolve around it. It I don't know um, but it uh, I think the thing that got people most pissed off is I. It, I only managed to uh, do it with like, two separate people, but uh, there's you know you can like use an item or a spell chameleon to change like to an object you find in the level. Yeah. And uh, well, you, know, you can still you can do that, and you can still move around by that object. So what I do is I you know get, uh, start summoning some to the world, and like in the downtime before they appear, I would transform and just fucking take off and wait somewhere. And I was somehow like in um, the best one I did was this guy was like he was searching the entire level for me, and I, I I made sure to clear out almost all the enemies that I could before doing it. it took a while for setup, and thank God it paid off. It's like I was. What? <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Sorry. I, just... I fuck. Did I ever mention I fucking hate Blight Town? <laughs> like he was. Um. He, I followed him just stealthily around the entire level, like as an object. I would just hide in the corner whenever I thought he was going to turn around. You know, and he, and um, he uh, we went through the entire level, like almost came back to the bridge. And that's when I just zipped out past him, like circled him twice as a vase, and just kept going and ran off. <laughs> <laughs> and then the best part was he found the lava somewhere chasing me, so I automatically won. <laughs> that's shitty. It was stuff that people deserve to get mad at. For. Yeah. <laughs> and I just, oh my gosh. Um. Fuck it. I'm not doing it anymore. Fuck the three big guys. Fuck them. Fuck them. <laughs> hell with them. Oh, but the uh, Hero Dragon Greatsword has a great special attack. Um, the um, the R two, the strong attack. It's oh. to, it's like the well, like the Drake Sword. Do it slams down, sends out a burst of energy, like, gives something. And it's in the effect it has. It, it will always knock down other players if it hits them. Uh -huh. So the, I found a couple guys who were trying to like, you know just it's basically you know bad manners to heal during a duel. Like, like that's how I see it. Like if it, if you're doing a straight up duel, whatever, just don't heal. Just fight the heroes to build it. Oh jeez! Get off of me! That's not pleasant at all. Not at all. Fucking biting you and shit. But uh, it's like um, I I oh my god, you're making me nervous. <laughs> I just um, anytime someone stopped to heal, I I would find I position I myself so I could I use the shockwave to knock him off the bridge. Uh huh. Which is in itself a kind of cheap kind of cheap move, but you know bitches get stitches. Yes. Was close. Uh, I kind of hate you a little bit right now. <laughs> Don't hate me yet, because, yeah, I'm about to get my ass handed to me if I'm not careful. Damn it! Let's, let me get... Oh, there they go! <laughs> There's just no way, man! Oh, it's all because it's all I watched you fly through this area on your playthrough this Yeah, game. I had no problem. I don't like, know it what's was, the difference you, I, I, I don't like you died once on that part. And right now it's fucking us both, like, right, right up the end. Fine. Ass. We'll take it slowly, then! Are we gonna hear you get loud too? Maybe. Cause I'm still fucking pissed. I don't. Th I don't think the world is ready for both of us angry. I don't think the world is ready for a lot of things. Yeah. Well. Cargo pants. What? What? Khakis. Khakis. <laughs> fucking. Talk. Give me the khakis. The pants? No. The, the khakis. What do you need? Khakis. No. The khakis. Oh, the car keys. <laughs> what? <laughs> but anyway, he's, he's from Chicago. <laughs> the khakis, that's great. Oh, it was wonderful. That's good. You'll have to ask our bass player friend about that story. Yeah, so Just so oh, I don't have yeah. to drop a name. I will. Are you fucking kidding me? If you yep. fall, so help me God. So, do you remember the story I told you about uh, while we were on the way to Get Chicago? Get up out of here! Um, probably. It was, it's, um, uh, I went to, uh, a year, about a year ago, I went with a friend of ours, uh, and another friend of his, to go to Chicago, because, uh, friend A is, you know, our friend, friend B is his friend, like, he's still our friend, you know, but it's just, a uh, clarification. Sure. Friend A, uh, was buying a car off of friend B's mom, who went to Chicago, we were driving up in one car, then we were going to drive back in the new car and leave the old car with, whatever. But we're up there, and we decided that, you know, as soon as we leave, it was early in the morning, um, we're gonna drop by Burger King just to get some breakfast. So we're uh, we placed our orders. We're pulling up, pulling around, and we actually hit the curb. And all three of us just woo! <laughs> <laughs> I pitched screw out. I don't know how we all decided that's what we we're gonna do. But yeah, again, uh, so we we get around to the window, 
and there is a very flustered young girl <laughs> at the restaurant. Do you all hear screaming? Like what? <laughs> it, I, oh God, I heard screaming. It scared the crap out of me. I actually hit the exact change button on the cash register. I hit with, the like, exact <laughs> change button. <laughs> like her manager was right there helping. They were like, "Yeah, sorry, that was us. We hit a curb." <laughs> and she was like, "What?" <laughs> That's great. Oh my gosh, three grown ass men just Come screaming. Me. Enough to scare. Motherfucking backstabs. <laughs> around and you'll see. Here he comes. You truly Damn it. Wish what, he's to really die. roaring. Yeah. What kind of. Why does he need to roar? I don't know. He's a giant. He's an ogre. He is? I don't know. I don't know what he is. <clears throat> That's what it makes me think of. That's actually, this was actually kind of disconcerting. I didn't like seeing him roar. It's just. <laughs> whenever I see a humanoid figure, like, however vaguely humanoid it is, just. Roaring like that, it kind of, like, especially they don't have like animalistic features. Oh yeah. I'm not talking like you know like a wizard man or something. If it, this guy just looks like a really fat asshole, <laughs> you know, I like, mean, he basically is. And it's uh oh, what's that over there that you can pick up? He dropped. Oh, we don't need it. Really? Bitch. Okay, that's cool with me. Dung pile. Okay. So, but uh, you want me to take out a couple of these guys? Do you want me to continue on or? I've. I don't trust myself right now. Like it's okay. if you like if it were me, just me playing, like I would I wouldn't have any trouble just doing so. I get it, but the fact that we have people watching this and they're gonna get annoyed a bite time eventually, it might be better for me to pass off the controller to someone who's not gonna struggle with this incredibly. Nice. Thank oh, you. That was a good dodge. Oh man. Oh, there we go. Much better. Maybe you know next time I won't take the initiative to just book it past everything. That did not seem like a good idea afterwards. At oh. first it seemed perfectly logical and then, well, chocolate guy came running at me. Damn it. Oh, I try oh yeah. I'm trying to remember, like, what was it that, uh, something we'll do with PV? There's, like, something I can see, like, when players would start getting mad. Damn it, see? Um... I'm no good at parrying. Like usually, I get, well, like when I have someone so regular that like for that duel, I got the bridge I was talking about. Uh -huh. If I, well, I would just I would start most uh, matches you know, with a wave, like to show you know it's friendly. Damn it! God, he wants that ass. Let go! Like Let go. I, I would just use a wave emote to, you know, like so goodwill, just you know, hey, it's a friendly duel, whatever. But um, if I, like with people who are just being dicks, like because like a lot of times it's the same people over and over that you're fighting because like they're just leaving some signs like over and over to try and earn uh -huh. dragon skills. So um, if I know that if anyone's just like, you know, being a real dick or just being real cheap, anytime they would appear to fight me, I start like with this, whoa, hello. Right. With a, it's called like the decapitate emo. It's basically you just look, you point at them and just, dra they drag their thumb across their neck. It's like, and uh, it's, okay, well, let's see how this works. And the moment I did that to anyone, I could see their fighting style just change. Like, they would go into a frenzy. <laughs> and it was beautiful. And like, I felt like that they even get more frenzy if I just fucking run away and don't fight and just make them chase me. Jeez. I'm a troll, I'm sorry. I noticed. <laughs> I don't know if I'd call it trolling so much as just pure dick and tree. Oh yeah, it's and um, like it's uh. Where does it go from here? Uh, I actually met someone that I've been doing like uh, like while I was doing that that we've been doing a lot of a co-op now. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um. I. Bitch. I I don't know how old, I I can't tell how old they are like a boy or girl they have a very androgynous voice that. Could be either like of any age. It's right. I don't know. It's I don't know. They're they're a pretty cool person. Pretty chill. So I'm okay with it. You know, like it's how do we, they have a very radio esque um, appropriate voice. Very what? Like it, it. They have a kind of voice that would be okay on the radio. It, which is still like and then. Um, <laughs> I mean. Like, as in like it's not grating. It's not gravel. It's not, like you know solid snake or something. You know we're not and we're not um, looking at a, I don't know Otacon. It's like one of my Japanese animes. <laughs> oh God! Did you go on any further back to the '90s on me? Jeez. <laughs> All right, I'm ready. Yes. <laughs> wait, wait. I, I was ready. I was waiting for. Oh God, that guy's booking it. <laughs> yeah, he's pissed. We'll he see saw it. me rolling. He was like, "That's not how you're supposed to get over here." He saw you rolling. He's hating. Oh, <laughs> that was much less was stressful. So I don't have to do it. I was like, I don't know how else to get down, so we're going down this way. It's really hard to oh see. man, so this this has been actually a really long video. We should probably take a quick break right here. How long is the video? We're at, uh, we're approaching 15 minutes. Okay, well yeah, we'll take. A we finally get we finally get a plateau. So I think this is a good place to go and stop. Yeah, so that went a lot better than than it was going. 
Um, I'll play until we get to the bonfire, at least. That way, if Adam dies, he's not going all the way back up top. I'm not, um, I don't even I'm insult at this point. I'm just, I'm, I, uh, I support yeah. this action. That way, that way, if we do die, it's not such a bad time. So, thank you guys for joining us. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and all that good jazz. This has been Deep Side Gaming. Oh my <laughs> God! <laughs> <laughs> the guy, sir, the guy. sir, <laughs> sir, I am in the middle of an outro, sir. <laughs> this guy is all him. <laughs> he finally got him. Uh-oh, 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 oh no! Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh, we can't even okay. end. Oh, no! End the episode. I'm getting shot at. I gotta get the fuck out of here! Just get to our statement. Just... We're getting... We'll see... You know what we usually say. We'll, we'll see, see you later. We'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye! He's still getting you! He's toxic! Run! Fuck. Heal! Use the purple moss club. Push down, arrow.